Hey everyone, welcome to Booster Tutor. I'm Brennan, and on the fourth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me. Let's find out and see. Okay, right, so day four of 12 days of Cracker Pack Miss, and our pack. Can't wait, what is it? Aldrich Moon. Okay, that works. Um, so, standard, and let's see what we get. Okay, Eldritch Moon, Eldritch Ch -ch 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 Moon, pack one, pick one, Choking Restraints already off to a good start, two and a white for a enchantment aura, enchant creature, enchanted creature can't attack or block, pay three, white, white, sacrifice it, exile, enchanted creature, so three mana to do a uh, pacify effect, that's fine, I mean, you're going to play it. But the fact you can later on remove that creature from the game, pretty good. If uh, they have like graveyard recursion or a way to blink it or something. Yeah, definitely a first pick. Spring Sage Ritual, three and a green for an instant. Destroyed target artifact or enchantment, you gain four life. I mean, that's too much mana just to destroy an artifact or enchantment. The gain for life is okay, but it's not worth the extra three mana that you're paying to get it basically. Or two mana, I should say. Boon of Emrakul, two and a black, enchantment aura, enchant creature. Enchant creature gets plus three, minus three. So, if you have something with a big butt, you can pump its power, lower its toughness, but, you know, you're trying to get in for damage. Or, what's usually used for is removal. So, sorcery speed, basically removal. At three mana, kills uh, a lot of smaller things. There's a lot of four toughness thing in the set though, that's what kind of sucks, but it's still pretty good. And uh, it's first pickable. I don't know if it's over choking restraints, but Woodland Patrol, two and a green for a 3 2 Vigilance. Three mana for a 3 2, that's okay. It's not horrible. The Vigilance is nice. Uh, it's a human, which uh, matters in this set, but not that great. Weirded Vampire, three and a black for a 3 3 Madness, two and a black, the Vampire Horror. It's not a good card. Four mana for three three isn't at all exciting. Paying three mana for a three three is for men's cost is like okay, I guess. Terrarion one. It's an artifact. Enters battlefield tapped. Pay two and tap it. Sacrifice it. Add two mana of any combination of colors to your mana pool. When it's been a graveyard for the battlefield, draw a card. It's a fine mana fixer, kind of like one time use, but you're not gonna first pick it, and you probably won't even run it that often. There's not that many, like, more than two color combinations in this limited set. Bold Impeller. Impeller. One red for a 1-2. Two. two and a red. It gets plus 2, plus 0 oh until end of turn. It's a Vampire Knight. That's horrible. One mana for a 1-2 is not great. The fact you have to pay 3 to make it a 3-2? Ugh. Gross. Guardian of Pilgrims. Two and a white for a Spirit Cleric. It's a 2-2. Two, two. When there's a battlefield, target creature gets plus one plus one until no turn. Two mana for two two. I mean, that's your basic. It's vanilla. Uh, you give another creature plus one plus one. That's fine. Um, I'm not gonna first pick this, but it's not a bad card. You'll probably run it in some white decks, but there's better cards. An Alighted Maniac three and a blue for a zero two. When there's a battlefield, put a three two colorless Eldrazi Horror creature token onto the battlefield. So, 4 mana for a 0-2, that's not good. That's bad. The fact, though, that you get a 3-2 when you die is pretty nice. So, you can block things. Also, you can use him as, like, a merge, emerge uh, enabler, basically. Feist-fueled, Geist-fueled, Scarecrow, 4-4-4-4. Four, 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 four. That's basic. Uh, it's vanilla. And creature spells you cost cost one more to cast. That's horrible. Like, why? I guess because it can go in any colored deck, but that's just... Ugh, gross. Graft Harvest, one black. Enchantment, Zombies Control have Menace. And pay three and a black. Exile a creature card from your graveyard. Put a 2-2 two -two black a zombie creature token onto the battlefield. You're not going to first pick this because, I mean, you have to go heavy... Van uh, sorry, heavy zombies. And even then, I mean, that's fine. But that's not what I really want to be doing. Ooh, Foul Emissary. Two and a green for a 1-1. One, one. 
Human Horror, when it enters Battlefield, look at the top four cards of your library. You remember you a creature card from among them, put it into your hand, put the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. When you sacrifice him while casting a spell with the Emerge, put a 3-2 colorless Eldrazi Horror token onto the Battlefield. Wow, that's a lot of text. So basically he's a 3... He's a 1-1 one, one for 3 mana. That's not good. He does get you a card though, hopefully. Um, if you get a creature, you could whiff though. They don't go in your graveyard, which kind of actually sucks for this set. And then you need something with a merge just because oh, that's a lot of hoops to go through. Um, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to first pick this because that choking restraint is just so good. White's really good in this set. We'll put him in the maybe and oh god. Deploy the Gatewatch. Four white white. Sorcery, look at the top seven cards of your library. Put up to two Planeswalker cards from among them into the battlefield. Put the rest of the bottom of your library in a random order. So you're paying six mana for sorcery that has to get you other mythics. This is a horrible card in limited. It's just, you know. If you have two other Planeswalkers, guess what? You're going to win no matter what usually. So, nope. Smoldering Werewolf. Two red red for a 3-2. When there's battlefield, it deals one damage to each, uh, each of up to two target creatures. Not bad, doing one damage. You could kill some spirits or something. Um, four red red, transform him. And he becomes Erupting Dreadwolf. Eldrazi Werewolf. He's a 6-4, and when he attacks, he deals two damage to target creature player. That's really good. Um, okay. It's definitely not those. I think Enlightened Maniac, you're gone. Sorry. So we have... Fell Emissary, I like. Too many hoops, though. Uh, Boon of Emrakul. It's nice removal, but it's not going to hit everything. And... Yeah, I mean, it's good. Don't get me wrong. But I'm not going to first pick it here. I like the Werewolf. 3-2 for 4... Mana, eh, but he does deal one damage. He can kill small things. Uh, Werewolves are pretty strong in this. His transform ability is really cool, but you have to go the choking restraints. Removal and white. White's amazing in this set. Um, yeah, this is really good. So I know it doesn't seem like it taking a common that's a three mana pacify, but it's really good in this set. So choking restraints, swollen werewolf. I don't really blame you. He's pretty good. All right, there we go. Eldritch Moon. Uh, remember, if you want to win that, everything before, everything coming up, $2 on my Patreon, patreon.com slash booster tutor. If you want to follow me on Twitter, booster underscore tutor. And see you tomorrow.